Okay, so we're going to try this one more time since I keep getting interrupted. Um, but anyway, um, I'm Monica, and I'm going to be talking to you about open source software. Um, this time I'm going to talk about Thunderbird 3.1, which is part of the Mozilla Firefox uh, company, um, except this is specifically for email. Um, I really like Thunderbird because it makes... Um, having multiple accounts really organized and really simple. I don't have to be uh, signing into five different accounts and five different websites. It just makes things so simple. I don't have to remember all these passwords. Um, but uh, basically, uh, this is the menu screen. And as you can see, everything here is really organized. Um, it has nice add-ons. Um, and uh, it has a page just for the features, but I'm going to show them to you. Um, so this is the download button. It's huge, it's really noticeable, and it's really easy. Um, it pretty much starts it automatically. I'm not going to do it just because I already have it or uh, downloaded, but uh, here's a step-by-step -step that uh, shows you kind of the process that it goes through. But even without this step-by-step, -step, it's really easy. Um, it's self-explanatory, just like any other um, standard setup and download process. Um, but I'm going to show you what it looks like. Uh, this is the this is Thunderbird. Um, as you can see here, I have two different um, accounts: one from my UFL account and one from Bell South. Um, it's just, it makes things really simple. Even adding an account is really easy, like new, <laughs> right here under file, and then mail account, and this is basically what you do, is you just add another account. Um, and then it shows up here, and then it takes a little, a little while to, um, download all the, um, all, like, for my, uh, Bell South that I haven't checked in forever, you can see I have, like, more than 1,500 emails and it had it took a while to get all those in but other than that it's pretty fast to do everything um, I really like it because you have the option of having the uh, your actual inbox up at the top and then the actual message at the bottom kind of like Outlook um, the only thing about Outlook is I feel like it's a lot less organized um, like for example right here you have these really easy um, tabs to click on like unread and I mean it's I mean it's pretty self-explanatory up here um, and uh, you can just basically do everything that you want to do in one screen um, what's also nice is that if you actually open up an email for example I just opened one up it opens up another tab so that you can have quick access to any email that you're opening let's say if you want to compare two emails um, you can do that without having to go back and forth, back and forth between your inbox. Um, so uh, another nice feature is if you just click on the uh, the person who sent you an email, you have a very easy um, uh, this like little drop down uh, menu comes up, and it's nice because you can add them directly to your address address book. Or you can compose a message without actually having to, um, without without you know a reply to this specific email. You can just create a new email altogether, um, or just copy the email address, which is also really nice. Um, so yeah, basically, it's um, it's compatible with both Mac and Windows. And it's just really simple and really organized, and um, I really enjoy using uh, Thunderbird, and I would definitely um, recommend it to other users. So, yeah. Thanks.